Okay, <clears throat> Scallywags. Uh, instructor Matt here <clears throat> aboard the 39 foot West Sail, the King's Pride, a fine sailing vessel in very fine scurvy condition. Um, I'm just doing a brief mechanical survey of things. I'm not cleaning things. What's that, a gas can? No big deal. Uh, but I'm looking at the engine, and as you can see right away, we have uh, a special start switch. Permanently wired in, uh-huh. But looks right, jumping our starter correctly here. Um, I already checked oil, that looked good. <clears throat> I checked fuel, uh, no fuel in the fuel tanks, or at least no uh, usable fuel. What we have is a, is a like one two gallon gas can. It looks like it has a gallon. Uh, we're gonna need more for our mission. Um, running through a pump that's not wired. I don't see why we need that. We've got a lift pump there. Although I better ask Jennifer about that because the, f the manual, function of that bad boy I know you guys probably can't see that uh, feels really floppy um, I did quickly bump the engine over and I haven't really gotten much response from it so I'm wondering if she was running the boat uh, just by keeping that little Walbro electric pump going so should check on that before we depart um, everything else looks uh, you know ABYC super sketchy um, Alaska standards eh, pretty standard um, but I did uh, exercise the shifter and kill switch. They did their thing, so we got that going. Um, if the beast tries to run away on me, I'm going to have to use three hands to plug all three intakes, but uh, I bet if I just kill two, that ought to be good enough. could always put my mouth over the third. Um, <clears throat> everything else, just a brief look at stuff. Uh, some signs of corrosion. I did check the through hole. Uh, it is open, looks sketchy. I checked the strainer. I actually didn't open the strainer. One sec. Oh God, that's that's a tough cabinet. Um, from what I can see, it looks uh, green as expected. But uh, from where I'm at, I can't really see in there. No worries. I'll check to see if there's some uh, flow out out the rear end there. Uh, I've got my battery switch on. Got some fuel in the tank. What's the worst that can happen? Here we go. <clears throat> Three, two, one, fire in the hole. Whoa, that's, you see the sparks right there? Those sparks are coming from the uh, pinion gear. That's exciting. Fired right up though. That's amazing. Uh, let's see. Let's see what happens here. Oh, it lives. A little shaky down in there. I don't know if you guys can tell. Might have to get some new mounts for this uh, this dinosaur. But I think we might have a runner. Sounds pretty good. Let's go see if we're actually cooling or just chewing up an impeller. Oh, look at that. Beautiful thing. She's spitting like a... 1920s baseball player. Very good. Very good. All right. At the helm here. Oh, wait. Most important. How about our levels? Uh, amazingly, the important one works. Oil pressure is pretty good for an old Volvo. Looking like 60. I don't know if we can trust that gauge. And believe it or not, the tachometer actually works. I'm impressed. Uh, we don't know about the temp yet, but that's a good start to things anyways. Throttle control works. We're spitting. If we bring some extra fuel, we might actually get this thing back to the school. If not, it'll be a good, exciting sea story to tell. Uh, how about shifter? I did uh, tie the lines on <coughs> tight at the dock here before testing this, but let's just do a little dock test. Try to put it on this boat so we can see if we move. Oh, we're going backwards. Oh, forward is reverse. Forward is reverse. Interesting. Well, let's try. Let's try reverse. Let's 
see if we get any crop wash. I got his tie pretty tight. We do have prop wash. That's good. We've got gears. And let's double check that reverse, which is forward on this. Didn't see anything exciting. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Look at all that. We got reverse. Which is forward. <clears throat> so, in conclusion, a beautiful day in Shelter Bay. I think we're ready for a sea trial to Anacortes, but we better bring fuel, uh, maybe a survival life raft, and probably a couple, couple beers. All right, another episode of Skagit Valley College Marine Maintenance Technology Scallywag program. We'll see you guys soon.